Ladies and gentlemen, I am Jimbo the Fuzzy, and welcome back to Sid Meier's Civilization VI. When we left off, we had these barbarians down here. We're sending our archer over to try and deal with them a bit. We're exploring up here. Damascus was building things very quickly, thanks to all its production and growth. And I had just one other little annoyance I want to mention, since I seem to be mentioning a lot of them. When I do my game saves, I keep one at the end of every episode in case something goes wrong, one gets corrupted, or something goes wrong with some of my episodes and I lose half a recording session. I can just go back to whatever episode I was at. But if I decide to come increment this, I can't click anywhere but the end. I have to go back manually. I can't just click somewhere on the file name. Just another little annoyance in the UI, and yes, they do add up. So now we will have our city attack. Why do I have to click that button twice? Just out of curiosity. Shouldn't I only have to click it once? Maybe. I don't know. Oh, we'll see. You're building a holy site, you're building a holy site. You got two turns left until yours is done. You have 13 turns, so yeah, that's actually happening, I guess. Here comes the archers. Good. You can go up on that hill there. Um, is this, that's, that is not a hill. Okay. Is a military animal, glories in gunpowder, and loves parades. Alrighty. Nader. Andre Darrow has it. Is there any up here? That's rice, that's deer, that's wheat. Got none over here. Just carefully. Well, Kabul has a lot of it available. Zanzibar, no. But, yeah, it looks like right now the only options that have it are city-states. So far as we can tell. So... I'd almost set up a city just to steal that nighter from Mahenjo Daro, but I don't feel like we'd be able to hold on to it very well. And I'd rather keep Mahenjo Daro as an ally and help them grow. Or, well, I'd rather stay their scissoring, I suppose I should say. So really no other nighter around. Oh, Russia definitely has some. Great. Okay, where do we go from here? I would almost say printing. Just get the Forbidden City. Alright, that, that would not be bad. And... It does provide the diplomatic visibility. Could do siege tactics for the highest level of walls. Which wouldn't be bad. 
Can move on to astronomy. Again, wouldn't be bad. Banking. I don't know. Here's an interesting thing. If we're going to settle up here, and that seems likely because it is connected to our empire, or what we have of an empire right now, City Range Strike can go after you. Builder can come back into the city. Thank you very much. But if we're going to come settle up here, we're going to be right on a lake. Which means... Plus one of many from entertainment for each lake tile within one tile of Huey Teokali. Plus one food and watch plus one production for each lake tile in your empire. So if we were to build it, oh, say, right here, that's one, two, three. If we were to replace those fish, that'd be five amenities. That might actually be worthwhile. Otherwise, you're looking at three. And the Dead Sea is... It acts as a lake, apparently, if I'm understanding this correctly. Which means that turns these two tiles, which are two culture and two faith each, into one food, one production, two culture, two faith. Which isn't bad. It turns all these into two, cult, two food, one production, and one gold, which, again, isn't a bad amount of production. So, yeah, and the amenities will help offset the lack of... Well, the fact that luxuries only affect four cities. Okay, you... I'm gonna send you to right here, actually. You as a builder can come to right here. And you as a builder... Um, what does Mecca need? Mecca needs more housing capacity, fine. Uh, I can't tell what to build there. So, yeah, I think going for military tactics now is a good idea. Beyond that, we'll see. We should probably go get guilds, but that says build two markets. And we are, however, building this last market here. So we will have that. So after we finish exploration, which is almost done, we can go... 15% growth for cities, not in your original capital. Kind of victories over... Okay, that's... Native conquest is probably worth getting. Um, see this? 100% industrial zone adjacency bonuses? That would be huge for us. Or is that commercial? Yeah, maybe... What I think, um, I think next turn I'm going to do that. Okay. All right, in just one.
Ow. Yeah, I knew I was going to have to go repair that. Okay, now what I'm going to do is switch over to guilds and then queue up exploration. So I'm going back to exploration. But this way I know I'm getting that market. And do lumber mills. Lumber mills do not provide me with extra housing, sadly. You can't shoot from here. Okay, how about you move over here? Can you still shoot? Yes, you can still shoot. Good. You got 4 XP from that, and my city range strike, which I shouldn't have to click twice for, I should mention, again. Okay, he's done with that. Now what are you going to go... Oh, Damascus needs to build something. Um, can't build a campus, can build an armory. Go do that. Hotten... Finish the holy site. Give me... Right, I think I can't... No, I've got walls already, right? I mean, ancient walls. Um... Here. Let's go. Terracotta army, I could start on. Hmm. Alhambra, no. Petra. Yeah, that's a generally good one. Um, yeah, out of districts to build. So, I'm going... What's in this encampment? Can't remember. Buildings. I have a barracks here. Okay. You know what that tells me? It tells me I could build a shrine, but the shrine won't... Are temples supposed to give you housing? I don't remember. Anyway. No. Well, I can build... And get a benefit from... I can start building a crossbow man. And that... Military engineer. Can you start roads, forts, and airstrip improvements? No. I'm going to go for the crossbowman, I think. I don't want to do the mamluk here because... They'll get more of a benefit in a city with the stables rather than the barracks. Uh, this builder is going to skip his turn. Air yeah, improvement was pillaged. Happens. Uh, you can go there. Hi, Jerusalem. You can come here. Okay. Yeah, Jerusalem's right near the Dead Sea. Cute. Construct a campus. Well then. I am at Jerusalem. Do I have any envoys with them? Uh, no. Someone else about them first. Russia is their suzerain. Do I want to fight with Russia? Automatically converts to the religion you found and exerts pressure for that religion as if it were a holy city. 
Interchable the city's state's resources. Cattle don't matter. Ivory does. Horses do. Yeah. Okay. I have good relations with all of those. Okay. Kabul, I've got no envoys with. Do they want... No, oh, well. Kabul is a quest, and that was inspiration for guilds, right? Jerusalem wants a campus. Preslav wants a great musician. How am I supposed to get a great musician? Candy wants a great admiral. And Mahanjadara wants a privateer. Well, I guess I'm not getting many of those done. Okay. Not built. No, I'm not building a campus district here. That is on the list of things to do with Damascus. I'm gonna build one right here, I think. Eventually. Possibly soon. Well, no. I need more population for that. Well, it should still be soon. But... Alhambra, I can put right here. And, you know, I'm going to probably do that very shortly. In fact, that seems like a great idea. Are you going to war with Mandodaro, Russia? <sighs> great. You probably are going to war with my little city. My pets that... Okay, Montezuma likes me. Although, in this game, that means absolutely nothing. Actually, in Civ, in general... How the AI feels about you means absolutely nothing. Alright, we can claim a great person. Would we like our great prophet? We would. Okay, I actually, you're not my capital. You are. And you're going to build a mine here. You're going to come over here and build a farm. Uh, how about, no, you're not walking away after pillaging that. Uh, let's see, is this a hill? Yeah, it's, no, it's plains. You die. Much better. Uh, you're gonna skip a turn until that scout gets out of range. Warrior is going to come right here. Good. All right. If I want that nighter, I'm going to have to improve it myself, and I'm gonna have to wait for my hundred Daro to get in their borders. Now I'm gonna have to keep them, and be fighting with Russia for them. It doesn't sound easy, and it shouldn't be. Um, well, the good news department. I don't know if Breslau is a... Oh, now you're asking for it, buddy. Okay, you've built that mine. 
There is nothing else for you to build right now. Here. So I'm going to send you... Down here. Uh, who needs orders? Martin Luther... Must be on your holy site or Stonehenge Wonder. And you have you sleep. Now you, little city, are going to... Shoot. And you, Archer, are going to also shoot. And hopefully that guy just died. And he did... And now I've got a promotion available for that archer. Awesome. Um, Guilds is about to get its inspiration, so it's going to be almost done next turn. Good. I have a warrior. Great. Russia's got their settler out. Which means I'm way too slow here. Okay, where's the city they can afford to lose one population? Cairo. I want to see where they drop theirs. That looks like it's coming south. Great. Just where I wanted to put mine. Alright, um... Skip turn, maybe I'll get a couple hit points. Builder, come over here, and, uh, you can repair that, alright? You can repair. Best of all, repairing doesn't actually use up charges. Alright. Now, where do I want to put this archer? Well, I'm going to turn him into a crossbowman first. But I'm probably going to put him over here in my holy site, actually. I think this game might have an interesting problem. Alright, there's the inspiration. Good. Now, I'm going to explain that problem right now. If you look at the units I can build. Here we have the musket man. I can't build the musket man because I don't have any niter. Musket man is a melee unit. It replaces, it's the upgrade to the Swordsman. I have iron, so theoretically I could build Swordsman. But I can't because, it, but I can't build any melee units at all because I don't have Niter right now. Which is really not a good thing. Camp Maturing is a great general. You give me great engineer, you give me great merchant points, and you give great profit points. Don't care about those right now. I want Alhambra, and I want to put it right here. Yes. And it looks like Russia's going to war with someone. It might be Mahanjodaro. Okay, Mecca finished what it was working on. I was planning, I believe, the, um... No, it was under civics. Ch not Chichen Itza. It was, um... No, it was under... It was under research. I was right the first time. Great Zimbabwe. Your trios get 
From the city, get plus two gold for every bonus resource in this city's territory. Must be built adjacent to a commercial hub district with a market and adjacent to cattle. I already built the commercial hub district here, so I can't put it here. Um, what was I going to do? Oh, yeah. I have my, uh, this lovely district. I want... I'm trying to remember what, what I was going to put it down and where I was going to put it. Don't need an entertainment complex right now. Not until I get a lot more housing. I could do an aqueduct. That wouldn't be a bad thing. No, I need the encampment, and I need to blow a lot of money on that encampment. Great. So what I'm going to work on in the meantime is the... Water mill. Send envoy. Okay, all right. Kabul. City states. Kabul does not have a suzerain, which is interesting. Um, C3 tiles, and it doesn't have any resources yet. If it can expand, it'll get that niter, and that'll be good. It might be worth getting that upgrade. Um, Preslov, could a great musician, Candy, recruit great emerald, Mahanjo Daro, train a privateer, extra plus two culture in every theater square district, fine. Two production in every encampment district when training units. Those are both, since I've got encampments everywhere already. Getting either of these would be really good. I have the connection to Prislov. Getting Suzerain status with Prislov or Kabul. I think the Aztecs will stay out of Kabul. They don't, and Kabul doesn't have a Suzerain. The Aztecs control candy. Um, and I don't know how to tell how many they have. Influence, but here we go. Aztecs have six. Two faith in every holy site district. Um, Preslov. Influence by two. I have one. Aztecs have three. I'm not taking Preslov from them. Kabul. Influenced by Aztecs have two. I have one. Short of me building another city near them, I'm probably not getting them. Which is annoying. I will say that. Uh, Mahendra Daro. Influenced by Arabia, Russia, Aztecs. I've got a pretty good grip on them. Do I have any th do I have any theater square districts? No. So that bonus is utterly worthless right now. I may as well grab the level six bonus from Candy. And if I can manage to recruit a great admiral somehow, that'd be even better. But let's get a little extra faith. And with that, I have once again gone way over on time. I apologize. Thank you very much for watching. I've been Jim of the Fuzzy. I hope to see you again next time.